Hello everyone, welcome back to the channel. Today's episode, what do you do when you have little pieces of filament at the end of the roll that are too small for a project, but you just can't bear to get rid of them? You create the Franken roll. I'll show you how. Okay, folks, so how do we create that roll of filament? Well, we're going to use this little guy right here. This is the Sunlu FC01 filament connector. And basically, it lets you put together pieces of filament by thermal bonding or welding. And I'm going to show you how to use it. As with any tool, this one definitely had its fair share of a learning curve. Now, if you follow the instructions, they tell you to turn the machine on. And as you can see on the screen, you can adjust it to whatever material you're working with. From PETG, ABS, PLA, polycarbonate and other material. Today we're just going to be bonding some PLA. Now the tool gives you an ample supply of these little guys. Just basically a little Teflon tube. And what you do is you take your material and you're supposed to cut it at a 45 degree angle. You do this for both pieces. You match up those 45 degree angles. In the PTFE tube. Then you wait for it to heat up for a minute with full operating temperature. Okay, now that the machine is up to temperature, you take both pieces of your filament in that little PTFE tube. You place it on the heating element and close the lid for a few seconds. And when it beeps, You release it, and your filament should be bonded. Now, if you move too fast, when you go to cut open the PTFE tube, you can wind up with problems like this. It don't bond correctly or it pulls apart. But thankfully to the rest of the 3D printing community, they came up with a solution. I'll show you how. So what was an easy solution for this type of problem? Well, a user on Maker World called George from Vienna created this which allows you to take your machine, slide it in, and have a fixture that makes it so much easier and stable to put your filament together.
So let's try this again with George's creation. So now that the machine is up to temperature, we'll place the filament in the machine. And let the machine work its magic. We'll let it cool for a minute. Now we'll cut the PTFE tube off and take a look. And just like that, bonded filament. Wasn't so hard once you actually learn how to use the tool properly. Now with a little time and assistance from that extra tool, you too can create your own Frankenroll with your filament scraps. And then eventually you can turn something like this into something like this. This is what Frankenroll produced. Multiple colors inside and out. I sure hope you enjoyed today's episode. Again, appreciate you watching. Please like and subscribe and hit that notification bell so that you get alerted when all these new episodes come out. And if you could, I'd really appreciate it if you could go to the Patreon page, check it out. Please become a supporter and help the channel out so I can provide more content for you. Again, thanks for watching. We'll see you next time.